Hi, Colin Lay here, the Chief Lawyer Human at Lay Roots, and we've gotten a lot of questions about how to avoid probate. And real quick, probate is a court process on which a judge transfers title uh, to your assets to your heirs after your death. Um, we've done a, another video about that, and just real quick, people like to avoid probate uh, because it's a public process, it takes a long time, and it's pretty expensive. Um, so people want to know how to avoid the process altogether. And I want to tell you about three uh, main ways that people do that. The first way is by having joint ownership on an asset. So you see this most often in real estate and also in bank accounts. Um, so a lot of people take title to their home as joint tenants with right of survivorship. That means if one of the two people passes away, the other person automatically becomes the sole owner of the property. So it avoids probate because it's just done automatically once the person passes away. Uh, second way is by having a beneficiary designation on an account. You see this most often in life insurance, uh, retirement accounts, IRAs, um, savings accounts, uh, basically, a lot of times you can designate who you want to receive your stuff when you pass away, and then it's done automatically through that institution, and you skip the probate process entirely. Third way is by using a revocable living trust. Um, it's a very easy and flexible trust to set up. You transfer title to your assets into that trust, and then when you pass away or become incapacitated, uh, control of those assets transfers to the people that you want, and that goes outside of the probate process, so it's private, it's faster, and usually cheaper. So those are the three main ways to avoid probate. If you have any questions, We'd love to answer them in another video. You can send them to support at layroots.com. And thanks again for watching.